Hey everyone, what's going on? Joey here and Happy New Year. Today is actually it's technically not New Year's yet. It is December 29th and me and the girls rented this cute little cabin in upstate New York. And I figured I would give you a little tour and tell you what we're doing for the New Year's because this place is absolutely amazing. Like legitimately, there's like a deer, just like there's tons of deer just hanging out here. So before we get started, make sure you subscribe, you turn on notifications and you give this video a thumbs up. Plus, please in the comment section right now, tell me what are you doing to ring in 2023? This is how we're ringing it in. We rented this cute little cabin in upstate New York. The place is called Wells, New York. And it's right on a lake. It's frozen, not too frozen though, so I can't go ice skating. But before we even got inside the cabin, we knew this place was gonna be amazing because there's deer everywhere. I'm actually staring at me right now because I'm talking really loud, so I have to talk really quietly. Hey deer! Now they're staring, they're like, what the heck is this guy doing? Every year at New Year's, you know, we like to go up to the mountains. This time, it's just the three of us, me, Julia, and Ira. Uh, though the rest of the family, they're all doing their own thing for New Year's Eve. I think it's the first time we're not with them for New Year's Eve. Um, so kind of breaking a tradition just a little bit, but this place is just so beautiful. And um, just wait till I show you the inside because it's all themed to bears. And for those who don't know, that is my nickname. So let's go inside and give you guys a tour. I just actually <laughs> dug this out of snow. It's about a foot of snow on the ground. It's a lot of snow. We're going snowmobiling in a few days, so hopefully that snow is still around. But this place is adorable. It's called the Good Life Cabin. Let's head in. We're going to walk in. This is the main entrance. They have a lot of cool theming here. A lot of information about where to go, how to get there. Make sure they go get eggs. And this is the cabin. Get ready for this. How adorable. They left all the Christmas decorations up, which is perfect. This place used to be a cabin from the early 1900s. That they converted into an Airbnb. There's a downstairs and an upstairs. We'll explore downstairs first. The girls are over there. We actually just unloaded and now we're kind of hungry, so they're getting dinner all ready to go. But um, you'll notice there's a big theme here, which is bears. Bears are everywhere in this cabin, including this one here. That's just, just me. But um, let's go ahead and show you around. Starting off with the living room. You see bear prints on the floor, the TV. We have some decorations we brought, so Happy New Year. You can see all the woodwork they put into this place. And they have this cute little Christmas tree here. Some really cute decorations too. I feel like I'm gonna have to get like one of these ones somewhere in town. It's too adorable. Looks like they made it. Got some 2023 gear. Don't wake the bear. Got a fire pit going. This one's interesting. It's Santa in a rowboat. Different. Here are the girls. What you making over here? Is it doing potatoes? What are we doing? Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Ooh, look at that. Here's Ira. I have an Ira's shoulder. You can actually see some of the deer. Look at them all. They're hanging out. Wow, look, it's a big one in the street. It's a massive one all the way over there. There's so many of them. This is one of two rooms. You got one here, another one in this corner. Told you a lot of bears. I love the thing. Now, what if you can actually see the deer from this window? Probably not. Uh, kind of hard. They're over there. But Bathroom is that way, and then up here is the bear den. You can see some bears under here as we head on up the steps. Just watch your head. It's for kids. Obviously, we don't have kids with us, uh, though I'm a kid. And the funny thing is, it looks really short, but realistically, this is like the perfect height for me. <laughs> now I'll be working on this trip, and there's a little, little desk over here where I'll be working at, uh, which is perfect. This is like the perfect spot for a kid. I love it. There's a little window. Let's see if we can see the deer from here. Oh, you can. Look. Look at the deer. They're just hanging out, enjoying life. Hey, girls. Hi. Hiya. 
And these beds are really comfortable and the sheets are adorable. Do you see these sheets? Oh, I, I need these. Somehow I need these. One thing that's gonna be really fun this weekend is that we bought a pinata, which is something that Julie and I love to do. But Ira's never hit a pinata before. So we went to the store and got a ton of candy. And uh, I'm gonna hoist this bad boy up. It's gonna be a lot of fun. There's gonna be candy everywhere. Candy everywhere. I have to admit this family, been, they've been doing this for many years. They decorated every square inch of this place for Christmas. Up here, they have decorations throughout the entire place, including up here. They brought in some of this kind of stuff. And the cool thing is, is that they left us some organic maple syrup and so many goodies but you know we have our own snack table we always do and, and this year i have to admit this is probably the healthiest snack area i've ever seen avocados i almost said onions apples why did i say uh, that's so weird oranges cuties pineapples uh one bag of cookies but we do have a lot of cookies they're just they're right here and we've got some really ones that are, are good for you well i think we're getting older we also have a, a hot chocolate station right here Ooh. on the side. A hot chocolate station here with all kinds of things you can add. The chocolate bombs, a little chocolate bears. Wait, we're going to melt down the bears? Yes, we're going to melt the bears. Oh my gosh. So the little Those look really cool. Marshmallow toppers, mini marshmallow spoons. So all kinds of things. This is going to be really, really good to eat. As Julia says, we keep exploring and finding more things, like cute little Christmas decorations here. And then one really interesting thing is that we're going snowshoeing tomorrow, I think, right? And so we, we brought two, of course, Ira doesn't have one just yet. And so I asked the guy next door where Edmund's from, I'm like, hey, can we borrow one? He's gonna give us one tomorrow. But up top, they have original ones, like the original ones. Look at these things. This is insane. It's kind of similar to the ones we use now. Obviously ours are plastic and different material, but it's so interesting to see what it originally was and what it became. So there you guys go. That is the tour. Let me know what you think. And once again, let me know what you guys are doing to ring in 2023. Anyway, if you haven't done so yet, please subscribe, turn on notifications and give this video a thumbs up. I'm Joey, stay safe. See you later. Bye.